What is up, everyone? My name is Phil. The channel is Phil's Polls. And we are back with another card opening video. Today, we have 20 packs. Yes, you heard right. 20 packs of 2019 Bowman Mega Box Mega Packs. They're the exclusive packs out of 2019 Bowman Mega Boxes, which were exclusively at Target. Lots of exclusives going on. So uh, leave a like, subscribe if you're excited for this. Um, if you don't know what uh, Bowman Mega Boxes are, they're basically these, you know, kind of standard format, same as you'll see is like with Topps Chrome Update and um, even 2019 Sapphire, I believe, was kind of that same for sort of format. Medium-sized box, big empty space in it, and uh, some packs at the bottom. And you got four regular packs, which I'll show you one of those. Not really anything in here, just Chrome and base cards, so... Um, I typically just uh, toss these aside and include them in packages. If you guys um, buy stuff from me, I'll just, you know, kind of include those as uh, like little card, you know, people like wedge a card in between two pieces of cardboard. Well, I just put them in between two packs because that's a lot more fun and I have a ton of them. So, how about that? So, yeah, you got those packs in there, but then these are what you're really looking for. These have the autos, the color, and the exclusive like mojo refractors in them. And 2019 was a good year because there's uh, Wander Franco in here and uh, a bunch of other good names. Wander Franco Auto, uh, Variation Autos, which get crazy expensive. They're like to 25 and uh, all sorts of other good stuff. So uh, we're going to open, you know, basically 10 boxes, but just the, the Mega Packs and uh, see how we do. So, uh, yeah, let us get into these packs. I'll set them aside. I will know right away if there's a hit because it is on thicker stock. And you'll see that it's uh, it's thick. It's a thick card in the middle. I'm sort of skeptical to buy these um, off of eBay just because of that fact. These can be weighed, um, these boxes, and it's about 0.4 grams heavier. So you need like a jewelry, jewelry scale to do it. You know, it can be done, but it's easier with the packs themselves. If they're sealed boxes, it's a little bit more tricky uh, because, you know, there can be variations in like the you know, the packaging or, you know, packs inside could, the regular packs inside could have, uh, you know, more cards in them and that could throw it off. So easier to do with loose packs. Definitely do not buy loose packs of these on eBay. I've seen some people just selling, um, these packs out of boxes. I would stay away from that. Um, so we got Diaz, Michael Chavez, a Kyle Wright insert, Christian Pache and Seth Beer. So no, no uh, hit out of our first pack. And I have noticed that these kind of, uh, there's less hits than 2018. Um, 18 had uh, Luis Robert in it, but not his uh, auto. But um, 2018, I found a lot more hits than I do in 19. Juan Pablo Martinez. There's an Alonzo insert. Spangenberger. And Hernandez. So that would be one box down of what you're actually looking for. And no, no hit to speak of, so... If we go this entire video and uh, I don't have a hit, uh, I'm pretty safe to assume that uh, these boxes were weighed because I did get these on eBay. But um, like I said, it is it is harder to do with the uh, with the boxes, but it can be done. So Duplantier, Victor Mesa Jr., Kristen Stewart, Matt Mercer, Ryland Bannon. So three packs in, nothing to show for it. Um, I did do one of these videos before, and I think we went like five, four boxes without a hit, and then finally got one in the last pack of the last box. Noelvi Marte, it's a nice card. Um, just the uh, Wander Franco base card is like 40 bucks. And uh, no hit there. Juan Palmer Martinez again. Vladdy insert. And Blaze Alexander. So yeah, you can do well on these, even if you just get like a Wander. It's like a $40 card, and then a uh, graded a 10 is like, um, I think it's like a, close to 100 bucks. Marco Luciano, another good one. Nice name. Miguel Amaya, a lot of people like him. Catcher for the uh, Cubs. And there, yeah, we got a hit. So I don't know if it's safe to assume these weren't weighed. He could have made a mistake, but... Um, and there's a nice card too, Julio Rodriguez. Probably the second best base card you can get out of these. Forrest Whitley, Peter Alonzo, and our purple. Not an auto, just a purple Ian Anderson. Not a first bowman. Um, but he was the third overall pick in 2016. So 
and a pitcher, so not going to sell incredibly well anyways. Um, but we did get a purple, so that's a nice, uh, nice little thing. And we got a hit back to back, so... Feeling pretty good about these. It's a green. Let's see if we can get a green auto. Ryan Weathers, Christian Javier, Andrew Kisner, and it is Christian Javier, 77 of 99. First Bowman, not bad. I did say I was going to set aside the hits, didn't I? <laughs> well, uh, that's all right. We can just we can just roll with it. Um, we'll do it this way. And uh, Jesus Sanchez, Luis Robert, not the year you're looking for, but still a nice card. And uh, Vladdy, again, not uh, not close to his first Bowman or anything, but probably sells okay, just given the fact that he's... Uh, and we got another hit. So if we don't see color, that means an auto. And that looks like a purple insert to me, which is not great, but chance at an auto anyways. Uh, Victor Mesa Jr. And Rowdy Telez, 249 of 250. Rookie of the Year favorites rookie card. Uh, really bummed. I think... Opening day was supposed to be like a week ago, and um, obviously that's not not happening. Everybody's you know kind of itching for baseball, but hopefully uh, these videos get you uh, a little bit of entertainment um, while we kind of hunker down and try to stay healthy and have nothing really to watch on TV, which is unfortunate. But uh, no hit here. Pete Alonso, Joe Adele, Dustin May, Weathers again. We've seen him before. I don't know how many packs we have left. Not too many, but um, Kybert Ruiz would love to see a, a, a Wander, even if it's just the base, and another Vladdy. I have pulled, I think, three Wander autos out of here, um, which is pretty good considering, you know, the checklist is not uh, not tiny. So Nova, and then there's also variations to look out for. Gavin Lux, Keller, um, which are pretty cool. I know there's like Casey Mize, and there we go. There's a, a Wander Franco base card. It's like 40 bucks. No hit in here. Joey Bart, nice card as well. Uh, Bo Bichette and Wander. So same uh, same image as his uh, first Bowman Chrome Auto and base cards, but it's just got that Mojo refractor. And uh, yeah, that alone goes for like 40 bucks, which is crazy. A lot of people uh, big on Wander Franco. And we got another Joey Bart, but no Luciano on the back, which isn't bad, but no uh, no Wander this time. So, nice pack. Uh, three packs to go. Hopefully there's another hit somewhere in here. Um, and we do have one. So I will set this one aside. So we'll see if we can get an auto. Um, <clears throat> but honestly, after opening a lot of these, I think uh, three hits out of ten boxes really isn't that bad. Um, 18, I noticed that you did get a lot more, but with 19, I've gone on runs where I've hit, like, hardly any. Uh, Nova again. Marte again. So, some nice base cards in those 19 packs. Let's see what this is going to be. And it's a purple. Doesn't look like an insert, so that's nice, at least. Uh, Miguel Amaya. Julio Rodriguez, so another nice uh, base card. Jimenez and... Tristan McKenzie. Heard good things about this guy. I think he's the uh, number one pitching prospect for the Indians. So not his first Bowman. It looks like he was drafted in 2015. So definitely not going to be his first Bowman, but uh, nevertheless, another purple. So to recap our hits here, um, a lot of nice base cards. I'm not going to pull them all out, but, um, you know, we did get uh, we did get a Wander Franco, which is always nice to see. And I've been stocking up on these and, you know, just grading the, uh, the Wanders. Oh, so I guess we actually got four hits. So I forgot one of them, but, um, yeah, a bunch of purples, which are going to be your most common. Obviously there are two, 250, um, and then a green and, uh, the purple insert, which I had forgotten about, but yeah, so that is our, uh, that's our video of 2019 Bowman mega packs, uh, 20 of them. Pretty fun. Uh, if you can find this product, like I said, beware of people uh, selling loose packs on eBay. I would stay away from that because, you know, these cards are thicker, heavier, and can be weighed. But if you can't find boxes, I'd feel pretty safe about it. You know, you're obviously not going to see them in Target anymore. This product came out a long time ago, right after 2019 Bowman did. But there will be 2020 Bowman. 
Obviously, if that doesn't get pushed back with the whole virus thing, which is which is a possibility, but um, I believe 2020 Bowman Mega Boxes are slated for like May-ish time frame, so a couple months away. But um, yeah, I hope you guys did enjoy the video. I like the hits we got, pretty cool. And uh, let me know down in the comments uh, if you've opened any of this and what you think about it and uh, who your favorite card that we pulled today was. But uh, yeah, leave a like, subscribe as I said before, and I'll catch you guys on the next video. See you.